This is the first time we've ever met in person, and we've known each other for well over a year. Yeah. So how did we meet? It, so it actually was just before the pandemic, and we were on a training call. Actually, it was a training Zoom, because we were Zooming at that time. Yeah. Lisa was saying a few things that were really resonating with me, and I thought, I really like her. I want to connect with her. <laughs> I want to see how she can help me build my business, and maybe I can help her build her business. Now keep in mind, she's on the East Coast, I'm on the West Coast. So a few challenges there with time slots, yeah. but well, you're very willing to get up at 6 a.m. because lots of times our things are sort of nine or, or afterwards. And so we, you know, both of us just, we, we immediately connected. It was kind of like, you know, when you meet people and you feel like, were you like past life sisters or something? And yeah, we're soul sisters. Yeah, we really, we just <laughs> really connected. And I think we, at first we decided we were going to try and be accountability partners. So we've made mm -hmm. a number of starts. Yes. We've had spreadsheets. We've done, you know, going to do all these kind of things, but we've actually just continued to become friends. Friends, and it's kind of hard to be a really tough accountability partner with someone who's become your friend. So when you're too close to friends, yeah. it's just not going to work. So we've <laughs> remained friends. Yes. Um, but one of the things that we've done, which has been kind of great, is that we committed to doing an EXP Explained every mm -hmm. first Wednesday of the month. Mm -hmm. So we do slight uh, spin on the regular EXP Explained. It's always different. We do use the basic slides, but we also wanted to offer value. So we do kind of a realtor roundtable. There's no lone wolves in EXP. Yeah. Even if you're an, an individual agent, there's so much help and support just surrounding you. So the collaboration, EXP is just top notch. Yeah. And that's That's, that business model, as we were saying to the business mm -hmm. model where, you know, when you introduce an agent to EXP Realty and they, you know, you refer them into the company, you do better if they do better. And that just doesn't exist anywhere else. And, and then in our situation, I do better if Barbara does better because it lifts up our company and our friendship. It's just one of the beautiful things about this company that you know, we're not even in the same downline. Mm -hmm. And so we've continued to see how we could lift each other up and lift up agents around us and also brainstorm things. You know, we, we shared a, a recruiting coach for a while. Yep. And when Barbara tries a certain uh, kind of, of whatever it is, she quick whatever she signs up for, she sends me all the stuff. Mm -hmm. And whatever I sign up for, I send her all the yep. stuff. And then we just continue to try to really raise each other's games and, and, and help each other out and have become amazing friends in the meantime. I was with a small boutique brokerage and I loved my broker. I still love my broker because he's also at EXP. And I was with him for you know a good 15 years. And he came to me and he said, hey, I'm thinking about making a change. And I thought, what are you doing? This is your company. What? No, you know, we can make this work. Don't worry, right? My broker showed me this business plan and the business model and I thought, why didn't we do this sooner? Because mm. I kept thinking about my mom, mm -hmm. you know, who is still working at, at 84 plus years of age, bless her heart. And she is a great agent. I mean, she still is, I still call her. I'm like, mom, this is going on, what should I do? But I kept thinking, you know what, if this business model was around when my mm. mom was selling real estate, she would be set right now. And I wouldn't have to worry about her. So for me, it was that retirement income. I thought, now I have, an, I have a way to retire with dignity and still be able to help other people. How amazing is that? Uh, my direct sponsor is a gentleman named Tom Trong, who was actually on stage today, an amazing, amazing leader, servant leader, great guy. And we knew each other through professional associations. We're both sort of serial volunteers. And he started to talk to me about it. And I was like, I'm all set. I have a very elegant brokerage. I get 95% of my commission. I'm all that in a bag of chips. Um, but he kept on just every once in a while, you know, saying things to me. And all of a sudden he sent me a text. This is so funny. I, I laughed that I actually fell for this. But EXP had hit 25,000. It was in January of 2020. And he sent me a text with that little graphic and said, but it would be a better company if you were here and I was like oh my god I love it so I mean trust me I probably was not the only one he sent that text to well, I always tell people I came for the money and I did I really did I mean it was a clear business decision it was math the rest of it I was doing on my own anyway I, I was nowhere near the brokerage and so uh, even though I loved them and they were elegant and lovely I was giving them a lot of money because I do have the great fortune to sell a lot of real estate I stay for the collaboration I stay for the amazing energy. I stay for the generosity. You know, you sit at these events and people are willing to give you everything that they've done. Where do you ever see that? Everybody's afraid to even look over their shoulder. Somebody said once the other day, remember the days when you were at, at a shared printer and something was printed and you ran over there to grab your thing <laughs> off the printer because God forbid somebody else would see your thing. 
you know, it's just the exact opposite of the culture and collaboration that we have here at EXP, and so I stay for that. Thrilled about the revenue share, thrilled about the equity. We, we actually purchased a lot of stock last year. I'm thrilled about those pieces, but really, overall, it's that amazing giving contribution energy that keeps me here for sure.